Israeli pharmaceutical company is suffering a strong criticism across the country following an announcement of massive layoffs coupled with revelations that it enjoys sweeping tax exemptions. The decision by Teva Pharmaceutical Industries to reduce its global workforce by about 10%, including the firing of 800 employees in Israel, means the company is on the defensive, fighting to save its reputation as the country's flagship company. Teva claims to be a moral company. If you are moral, you should consider that once you get tax breaks, then it means that you cannot fire people in Israel unless it's the last resort. But as far as I can see, and I've seen some figures, this is not the last resort. Uh, you might look at the outrage that uh, this uh, step was uh, uh, accompanied with as part of the Israeli citizens' look at Teva. Uh, it, it's as if uh, Israelis were insulted that uh, such a company that they uh, feel towards as national pride and uh, invest in it, and also helped it, uh, took this step, took this measure, uh, letting these people uh, uh, from their workplace and uh, in such a large portion that you might, so you might say that if it was another company, normal commercial company, none of this would have happened. Teva, which last year reported net revenue of more than 20 billion U.S. dollars, announced the layoffs last week as part of a restructuring plan.